My name is David Wren and I'm Programme Director of the BA Honours Graphic Communication course at Cardiff School of Art and Design. The nature of the Graphic Communication course at Cardiff School of Art and Design explores the communication of ideas and concepts um, for a variety of different audiences using words, image and storytelling, um, which is an inherent part of what we do. Um, and that's across a number of different contexts, so that could be uh, book design, it could be animation, it could be web, it could be uh, digital technology sort of applications. Um, so it does tend to, to span across a lot, lots and lots of different contexts. So ideas are central to what we do on, within the course and this is a really inherent part um, of all projects that students take part in. Um, students are encouraged to develop work that's reflective of their, of their career aspirations also um, and we, we support them um, as, a, as, a, as an academic team um, at every stage of their development. Um, there's a number of opportunities for students to engage in um, field and exchange trips throughout the curriculum. Uh, most recently we, we've had students take part in trips to uh, South Korea, Rajasthan, um, London, a bit closer to home, and Morocco. Um, some students tend to take part in the Erasmus programme um, within Europe and uh, do so for one term to up to, the, to a full year, if they, if they see fit. Um, and we also invite students and have students from all corners of the world that come and study with us um, for various amounts of time. Um, with regards to work experience, students are encouraged to take part in work, work experience throughout their three years um, in the course and they also have an option to do a work experience module at level five. We look for applicants uh, with an inquiring mind and that's really, really important. So um, applicants that have a really interesting sort of storytelling um, and that in itself is a, is, a, is a massive part of the course. It underpins everything that we do uh, as graphic communicators. Um, Project briefs can span across kind of political, social, cultural and technological contexts and so it's important that a student has a, has a real interest in, in the world around them. So I guess the, the broad nature of the course, I guess the fact that we cover lots and lots of different um, areas that relate to graphic communication, um, that tends to allow our students to progress into to a variety of different career um, careers uh, which include branding, um, marketing, advertising, publishing and interaction design. So some students prefer to work within a 2D context, so design for print, um, uh, whereas others uh, much prefer to work in digital contexts or uh, like to work in sort of three-dimensional three -dimension spaces um, or work on interactive design. Um, some of our past graduates have worked for companies like um, Wheaton & Kennedy, um, Dayer, Brand Union, Sky, Moving Brands, um, in places like New York, London, um, Australia um, and further afield. What's just as important is that some students uh, choose to work more locally and uh, some eventually end up setting up their own practices, whether it be in Cardiff um, or, or in other places, which obviously is, is just as important. I guess collaboration and transdisciplinarity are a, a huge aspect of the curriculum um, here at Cardiff School of Art and Design and there's many, many opportunities for students to, to take part in collaborative practice. Um, it happens within the course, so within the graphic communication course, but it also happens kind of um, holistically across the whole School of Art and Design. Um, I would say that essentially within CSED we're a community of practitioners that um, work with um, similar sort of um, ideals and principles and um, work within various contexts and projects to sort of um, realise those ideas. The graphic communication course is an award-winning course uh, and we have strong relationships with the, the local graphic design industry and further afield. We have a programme called Afterlife where um, we invite graduates of the course to um, come and speak to our students. Um, it might be that they're alumni or uh, professional practitioners um, that have worked with us or not. Um, and they come and they work with the students on life projects and offer advice to students that are making that kind of transition into the, the real world, into the, the big bad world of the graphic design industry. Ideally, we'd like to see applicants that have um, curiosity, and that's a massive, massive part of what we do. Um, curious minds lead to really interesting places uh, with regards to project outcomes. Um, we love to see students uh, process and development within their portfolio, so sketchbooks are a massive, massive part of what we do. Um, and that kind of gives us an insight into, into a student's um, thought process and how they've arrived at a final outcome. Uh, uh, sometimes the process is just as important as the final outcome and it's, it's definitely something that we celebrate uh, within the course. Um, we'd like to see students that work um, and they have explored um, lots of different media, lots of different contexts, 
Um, but more kind of specifically that have an interest in uh, developing a relationship, developing a relationship between words and images. Um, but also in telling stories because that's a really fund fundamental part of what we do here on, on the graphic communication course.